You say that uh, vanishing hands about the bus people. How do you mean that? These people that that we call the bus people, that everybody thinks of the dregs of society, might just be here for a reason. Now, I don't need to go into it any further than that, but they have an important part to play. That was one of them now. <laughs> I keep several from the background. There used to be this guy that walked around, he had a cowboy hat, bowed legs, and real old jeans. And he just would stand on the bridges, and every time I'd drive over this one bridge, he'd just look at me. And I thought, well, maybe this guy knows who I am somehow. <laughs> and that's more than, yeah, well. And then I started thinking, what if this guy has been waiting for me to drive over this bridge? And then I thought, what if all these bus people are just waiting to give some message to us when we get smart enough to figure out what it is? The vanishing hand. Well, I can't tell you what the vanishing hand is. I just can't do it. That was it. <laughs> It just came through the roof. Edit that out. This is what happened to the last person that tried to talk about the various <laughs> it, it actually revolves around the Invisible Hand Society, which is a, a group uh, that's dedicated to bringing enlightenment to the to the uh, planet Earth. <laughs> hey, you told us we were going to start talking about that. Yes, Kevin. <laughs> is this based out of Wayne Dale's? <laughs> <laughs> oh, the cat's out of the bag now. H.P. <laughs> Lovecraft is, was really into this when he talked about Cthulhu, but now that the wind's picking up in the sky, <laughs> <laughs> I'll stop talking about it. The That's why you've never heard anything about it. I didn't it. think we were going to talk about that. That's what I said. I can't answer these questions. <laughs> hey, wait. Stop the camera. <laughs> the return of the vanishing hand.